The system CDR is basically the overall view of the design aspects, and so it has been a, a six-year process to get to this stage. And so hundreds of engineers and scientists from around the world, from the member uh, country institutions, have participated. I was involved with ALMA and now at ESO with ELT, so it's about the same scale size of complexity. Each project is different, of course, and uh, comes with different challenges. I think that that's one of the attractions for astronomers and engineers is working out how to overcome these challenges. And I think they've really got the right team in place to do that. There are a lot of experts on board and people are so eager to actually make the SKA the best telescope it can be. The sets of the requirements are, are quite challenging technically. And so finding designs that can actually fulfill that performance uh, are difficult. And so we've gone through a number of different prototyping stages. Some of them were not successful, but that's the reason you go into this. You learn a lot about uh, the designs, their practicality, and you refine that. There are lots of precursor observatories that we're benefiting from. There are other observatories around the world that are doing, that are large facilities like the SKA. But in terms of the overall scale of the project and its audacity in trying to address all these different facets, it really is unprecedented. The SKA is going to be one of the major observatories for the future. It'll be so complementary to the, the other great observatories that will be around the JWST, ALMA itself, the uh, ELT telescopes in the optical and infrared. The team has really been outstanding and I speak not only of the, the team here at the, at the headquarters but also the broader team from our member institutions that were so supportive throughout. If you look at what's been achieved in the last few years, it's really quite remarkable. And this year in particular has been a huge push with the creation of the, uh, the IGO, the design really coming to maturity. Certainly looking from the outside, it's uh, very, very impressive. They've done a tremendous job of actually getting the consortia to the point where they're able to just to, to move forward with the actual construction. Having this uh, milestone uh, of the system CDR is really the foundation for everything in 2020. This is the year where we have to pull together the construction proposal itself. It's just so exciting that right now it's actually all coming together to the point where it's a tangible project. It looks like a telescope now. We've gotten our wish. We get to continue to move forward on the project and it is fantastically exciting to really see this observatory beginning to come together transitioning over the next year from the analysis and documentation exercise that all the planning is intact to the actual execution and that's fantastic. Thank <music> you.